Hello, this is CyberDoc. Today I want to give you a product review for our new product, Screwphilic Magnetic Screw Chart. It's essentially a magnetic screw mat for iPhone screw location placement. So, the dimension of it, if you're familiar with this product, it's, a, it's an A5 page of size. It's a 9 9 inches horizontally and 6 inches approximately uh, in width so vert vertically is uh, nine, nine time, 9 inch times by 6 inch a single sided magnetic mat so this side is not magnetized and this side it is it's double sided lamination so it's tightly air sealed, airtight sealed you don't have to worry about UV radiation damaging your quality of the mat or water, spilled coffee, you name it, even beer. It's and it's resistant to scratch, so you can scratch all you want with the screwdriver or your nails. The mat will not be damaged. See. Okay, so given say that to that, it com comes in patterns of right now, currently we have the iPhone 4 GSM for AT&T model, iPhone 4 CDMA for Verizon Sprint, iPhone 5, oh, iPhone 5 model, and iPhone 4S model, and iPhone 3G and 3GS. Every Mac counts with a color coding sequence. So this is the amount of screws and Based on, the, based on the color coding, it shows you which one screws you want to unscrew first in order to get to sequentially the next one in order to do a complete disassembly of the model, in this case iPhone 4S. This is the iPhone 4, white iPhone 4S from Apple. And this is just to show you the size of the mat from CyberDock, CyberDock screw mat. This is the size of uh, iPhone 4S. This is the size of the mat, which is more than enough for you to do the re clearly to do the report uh, repair. It's a lot bigger than the other um, screw mat that's on the market. So it was designed this way so you can see better when you do the repair. Okay, so we can say that these are the screw mats and this, these are the screws. Let's test like how good these screws are adhering to the screw mat from CyberDock. So now I'm placing some screws in different orientations. Some are laying horizontally, some laying vertically. Obviously the vertical one will have more traction to the uh, magnet. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to tilt this mag tell the CyberDock magnet to different degree of angle and shake it like this. So this is 60 degree or 45 degree actually. So I'm shaking. The this screw moved a little bit but it stays in the same location. It's just shake. Now I'm doing 90 degree. This is vertical cliff 90 degree cutoff. Look at the screws. Oh, There we go. Look at the screws, they're barely moving. I'm doing 90 degree right now, and let's do the one complete 180 and shake. Okay, as you can see, five out of four, four out of five screws are staying its original location it has not been moved only one that originally was here that moved onto the side after a 180 shake i'm oh, sorry 360 shake no what's that one 180 180 degree shake not 360 well yeah i, I turned the 180 and then 360 but anyway this one move out from its original location only because it's in the edges of the mat and these four has been staying in the same location, being tracked even after a complete 180 turn. There you have it. This is the new product, CyberDock Screwphilic Magnetic Mat M Series. This is the M Series. This is different from our uh, original 
um, double-sided magnetic mat. Given that the double-sided magnetic mat is an A4 size, and these are A5 size, so it's half the size of the mat. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time.